Dickie Betts, Ramblin' Man. Now, I'm gonna tell you something. I love this song. That's why I'm doing this video. Dickie Betts with the Almond Brothers. I don't think he wrote a whole lot of stuff, but boy, when he did, watch out. He wrote some great songs. And this song just blows my mind. And this video of it is unbelievable. And I'm about to bring it up right here. It's the Almond Brothers Band, Ramblin' Man, 11-2-1972 at Hofstra University. Official. This is official. Dickie Betts. Ramblin' Man. Bang. Computer. <laughs> But now this verse to me as a songwriter, you know, my daddy was a gambler down in Georgia who wound up on the wrong end of a gun. So great. And to back that up with a line that's iconic that everybody knows just blows my mind. I, I mean, how do you back that up with something greater than I, my, my daddy wound up on the wrong side of the gun and then, you know, double down on that? Good Lord. So good. I'm going to say this too before we get this is kind of long and I'm going to, I'm not going to talk much but Dickie Betts has a voice as a guitarist. He's one of those guitar players that when it's Dickie Betts playing it and you don't even know it you hear it and you'll be like that's Dickie Betts. That's the hardest thing in the world to do. Be able to play the same scales the same everything everybody else is but you, but he does it in a little way that's so Dickie Betts and that it's just beautiful. <laughs> This verse is great too. Listen to this verse. Those Delta women think the world of me. say that shirt if this was in color i bet that's a very very colorful shirt i bet there's a lot of colors hippie like shirt see hippie girl hippie clothes now, now i'm just gonna look at how patient he is with his guitar playing he just starts off down there and then he builds this thing in only in a way that only he could do it
He's very patient. So he gets up there where, where he really shines. that was that's in the video I'm gonna say something for you guitar players you know Dwayne Allman with the slide get that that great sound that you can't do without a slide but I don't know if Dwayne Allman rubbed off on him or what but Dickie Betts almost sounds like he's using a slide when he gets way up high on that Les Paul This is what the Allman Brothers did, kids, back in the day. They would just jam out on it, you know? And as you can see, all the hippies, they'd probably been smoking dope all day. And then they go to the Allman Brothers show, and they trip out while he jams out. That's what they did. tell you one thing about Ramblin' Man, that song. I I know where Dickie Betts got the song from, and I'll play it, a little clip of it. No discourtesy to Dickie Betts, but I do believe that this is what, you know, kind of kicked it off. This is called Police Dog Blues. Lord, I was born a Ramblin' Man. All my life I've been a traveling man. All my life I've been a traveling man Staying alone and doing the best I can So that's all I'm going to play because I just wanted to show you that, but the likeness there, which is cool, but he's a great player. We'll do a video on Blind Blake later. And I'll tell you everything I think about Blind Blake, and it's going to take probably an hour because I love the guy. I absolutely think he's one of the greatest ever. That's my opinion. Who knows? Dickie Betts may have never heard of Blind Blake, but I doubt it because most guitar players do know about Blind Blake because he was one of the greatest. Dickie Betts with the Almond Brothers Band, 1972. Rambling Man. I am not a fear monger in any way, but this man did not subscribe, and this man did not subscribe, and this guy did not subscribe, and neither did her. So I strongly recommend you get off your keister and subscribe to the Super Fantastic.